Hello YouTube and welcome to my first Blender Minecraft application tutorial. In this tutorial I'm going to show you how to get the rigs, all the things that we need to start animating for Minecraft. And rigs are sort of like bodies of the characters and the blocks that we need to download in order to start making animations. So I have the links open to my browser ready and I'll show you the first one that I recommend. The first one is the standard Minecraft Blender rig made by Schnitzel Killer. I hope I'm pronouncing that right. His rig is good when rendered. It looks like this, but it's been updated since, so it might look a bit different. Personally, I don't really recommend this one because it's got so many problems downloading it that um, it's just not worth it. But if you really want to use it, you can um, download it somewhere on this page. I don't know where it is. Probably here. But um, there's a couple of pros and cons between the two rigs that I have set up for you to download. And so the pros for this one are, of course, that it's made for Blender. It's relatively easy to use and to f how to figure it out. You don't need to know <laughs> as much things I'm going to teach you to use this one. And it's really popular. As you can see, there's like... 54 pages in the thread, so it's pretty popular. And it's the, like, what am I going to say? It's fairly easy to use, and it includes the sky, as you can see here. The other one I'm going to show you doesn't include it. But, um, some of the bad things are, is that all the stuff that you would use is only in one file. It doesn't include all the blocks, like it has grass, dirt, wood, logs, cobblestone. But it doesn't have everything. Like it doesn't have, it doesn't have pistons. It doesn't have anything 1.7 plus. Um, it doesn't include any items like swords or pickaxes and things. You'd have to make that yourself. And that's really the bad stuff about it. And if you think about it, the bad stuff kind of overweighs the co the pros. So I wouldn't recommend this one. On to the next one. The this is the one I use. It's the Blender 2.8. 2.58 Minecraft rig that also works for 2.61, which is the one that we're using. It's made by Scarb, and this is better. As you can see, it has pretty much all the blocks. It has several character rigs, as you can see here. It has things that aren't really blocks, but are kind of blocks, like, um, voice just cracked. Like, rails, ladders, torches, all this stuff, and it does have items, too. It has separate character rigs, a separate character rig that has a, um, a thing that you can use to make like heads and hair and stuff like that. It has the piston and it actually has a creeper. Oh, I forgot to mention that the other one also does have a creeper, but it's a bit hard to access. And so, the pros about this one is that it has pretty much all the blocks. There's a person down here who added some blocks to it, these ones notably, and you can download that instead of the one that's featured on the top. It's also skin compatible, as the other one is, but this one's fairly easy to do it. It doesn't require the um, fix that the other one does, because when you render the other one, it's all blurry, and no one wants that. But I'll teach how to explain that. I mean, not teach how to explain it. I'll teach how to fix it anyway. Um, it has items, and the other one actually has an apple, which you might want. And it's located, like it gives you several files when you download it. So this is one file, this is another that's another, this is another, and so is this. But, um, I recommend this one over the other one. But it's a bit harder to use because, as you can see, when you open it, you really want, wouldn't, wouldn't want to use this whole thing. There's a technique we can use to take certain blocks and things from it, like if you wanted to take this, that just that one dirt block, we could do a special command in Blender and take that out and use it separately with the other one. You have to, like, open this and then delete the blocks you don't want, which is a bit difficult. But, so I recommend this one. Most people don't use it. I'm, like, the only person on YouTube that I know uses it. But it's actually, in my opinion, it's better. And, yeah. Um, but the one pro big problem with this is, is that there's not many tutorials for this. Which is why I started this series entirely. And... It's, well, my series is like a tutorial series on how to use Blender, but also how to use it with Minecraft. So, and that's pretty much it. I'll leave it up to you to decide which one you want to download. I recommend this one, again. 
and thank you for watching this tutorial, and be sure to subscribe to see when my next tutorial will come out. Thanks, and bye.